doing too much. Um. Yeah, like I said, though, um, Ben Zeno is a very messy guy. If you ever hang out with Ben Zeno, make sure you watch what you do because he will expose it for clicks and views. He went and exposed that Trick Daddy was had a blunt with coke in it, my nigga. What they call that, a wooler? He exposed on Drink Champs that Trick Daddy, while he was on, I guess he did Trick Daddy's show. You know, Trick Daddy got a cooking show, right, out there in Miami. And he said when he went out there with with Trick Daddy, that Trick Daddy had a blunt that smelt like cocaine. I can't make this shit up. Props. So shout out to Memphis, man. I love them niggas. And I, and I love to death Ray Kwan and motherfucking Ghostface. Because they keep it. Because the man said that. Back then, we was experimenting with Because the man said that he'll put himself smoke. on the cover every single time. If he the first time the I did an interview with Trick Daddy right down in Atlanta. In, in Miami. He, 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 he left a joint. That shit smelt. Yeah, yeah. the most coke I've ever seen. It was, oh my God. I love Trick Daddy. They were smoking that. Dirty, dirty. I know about it, but I'm like, damn, you doing it in the interview? See, I love Trick because niggas. Dude, who you are? He'll tell you. Who you are, man. Yo, Sonny, you did coke before. <laughs> He's so Sonny, slap it. You did coke, Sonny. So don't, don't fucking... It's nothing to be ashamed of. How are you, Sonny? He did both back to cocaine. We all did. If you're 55 and over, you did coke. I'm 46, sir. You did coke oh, before. Did coke. You did coke. Or did my kid. Never did coke. Anybody want to be like, I did coke. Anybody want to do coke. Zeno, you... you oh, man. Benzino, 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 man. It is what it is, man. What's the moral of the story? Moral of the story is Eminem got this guy right now twisted. Like, Eminem wrote Risen the Dead, meaning Benzino. You know, Benzino finally got the response he always wanted from Eminem. It took 20-something years, but he finally got the response. And he couldn't even handle it. Benzino could not handle the response. Yeah, he responded with a dish record. But it got him out here looking crazy and crashing out. Shout out to Eminem. Fake news. Fake, no, 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 no. fake drink chance right now. No, 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 no. Fake drink chance. Right Let's make that chance. A little bit of bullshit. Yeah, yeah. Drink hey, shit. You know why I gotta last the whole night? So listen, we'll, we'll keep going. You give me another shot. I told you I was gonna drink you. Oh. Yeah, I mean, he's fake there. drink champs. You know I'm the real there, drink sir. champs. Watch this. No, no, no wheel. Ask me to pick you up. No wheelchairs. Hey, fuck that. Let's talk about Eminem. No, oh, man. Hold on, hold on, we coming back. Just sit down, sit down, sit down. Why are we wasting our time on a small talk? No, 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 no. We already talked about Eminem. The only reason about. I'm here is because Eminem. No, 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 it's not the only reason. I wouldn't be here if I didn't <laughs> destroy this nigga with Rap Elvis. Yeah. Rap Elvis is hard. Come on, man. Rap Elvis is hard. Rap Elvis is hard. I can't lie. I can't lie. Rap Elvis is hard. The stand, the roots stand, the stand, the stand, the stand, the stand. Do y'all think Rap Elvis was hard? Did, did anybody, like, first of all, did anybody 